Hi everybody, this is day 31 of the 3030 challenge. So you're probably wondering, what, 31? Didn't she finish? But I'm not finished because there is more information to share, a lot more information. We just finished a tour with over 60 people and believe me, there were a lot of questions over those days. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna continue answering questions and not only that, but Gary Keller, who is the founder of Keller Williams, says in his book, The One Thing, or in Spanish, Una Sola Cosa, that it actually takes 66 days to create a habit. So I continue, and I have a question for today that we got over the weekend. And that question is, bank accounts in the Dominican Republic, how do I open a bank account and what is required to open a bank account? And actually we helped a lot of people open their bank accounts uh, today and also tomorrow. So here are the requirements to open a bank account in the Dominican Republic. First of all, there are various banks here. There's Scotia Bank, there's Popular Bank, BHD Bank, and the one that we're working with our clients right now is Santa Cruz, Banco Santa Cruz, because right now they are the easiest to get accounts open. So here's what is required. Number one, your passport. Number two, a second form of ID, like a driver's license. Number three, a copy of your social security card. Number four, a W-2. Five, uh, about three months worth of bank statements. And then also, um, I just forgot what was the other one. Oh, actually, money to actually open the account, like around $500. So very easy information that I'm sure you have at your fingertips. And you can open a bank account in the Dominican Republic in U.S. dollars. You can also open a peso account for Dominican pesos if you like but most all business is done in US dollars and you can open a US dollar account. You can get access to your account online. You can pay bills, you can wire money back and forth. You can do whatever you need to do with your Dominican US dollar bank account. So uh, any other questions, keep them coming. I have a whole list of questions, so we're gonna continue with the education. Now let's see about getting to 66 because actually after 30 days, I feel like I'm just getting started and I actually feel really great making the videos. So many people are also engaging in the challenge, which is great. So this is interesting information for everybody. Keep the questions coming and I will continue doing my daily videos. Thank you guys.